Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, welcome. Today I'm gonna share with you my Grinch coffee slash cocoa bar, so if you guys wanna see my ideas, then please keep watching. All right, we're gonna hop right in. I'm gonna start refilling my Nespresso pod holder. I got a ton of new holiday flavored coffees this month, so I'm super excited to try those. So we're gonna go ahead and fill that up. Next, we're gonna move on to replenishing our candy canes and our straws. My daughter, she has eaten all of the candy canes from my previous video. If you guys haven't seen my gingerbread um, coffee bar or cocoa bar ideas, I will link that down below. I did pretty much the same thing as far as like the coffee syrups and the toppings and some of the goodies. I did get some new goodies for this video, but definitely go check out that video if you want more inspiration. Just filling up these little mugs I got from Hobby Lobby with some kisses and some mints. And then I got these chocolate dipped spoons from World Market. Definitely check them out for all your holiday goodies and they're at a fair price, plus you can get a coupon. Then I got these cookies from Walmart. They looked really good and very Grinch-esque, so we're gonna use those later. And now we're just gonna refill our little stirs. I've got these peppermint stirs and these thin mint chocolate spoons from Dollar Tree. They are so good. I got so many packs and we've already gone through a ton of them. So I'm just gonna refill those. Now I got these set of four glass jars with lids and spoons. They're really nice. I'm gonna go ahead and refill those. We've got some mini chocolate chips, some crushed peppermints, and then I've also got some marshmallows and some hot cocoa bombs. Just gonna refill these marshmallows with the peeps. The Christmas tree peeps are so cute. They have snowman ones. I've seen gingerbread men ones. Really adorable and great for hot cocoa. Now here I just wanted to do something fun. Um, I had an idea to do the individual canisters as you can see there, but I just didn't have enough stuff. So I decided to mix it all together. So it's basically little mini ornaments, little mini presents, and then light bulb ornaments. I thought that was a nice touch. If you know anything about the Grinch, you know, he steals presents and unwraps the trees and <laughs> removes the ornaments. So I thought that was really cute and it matched our theme. So now I'm just gonna start putting the cocoa coffee bar together. I got these two trees from Kohl's. They're really adorable, but kind of pricey. So keep that in mind. If you do like them, wait for a coupon. Now we're just gonna put our jar up there. Really, really love this. It came out really cute. Now this idea, I got this sled from Hobby Lobby. Basically all this stuff is from Hobby Lobby except for the little Grinch. He's from Walmart, he came in a glass cup. But I wanted it to look like the Grinch was sitting in the sleigh and stealing the presents. You'll see later I did add something else. I just didn't feel like that fit the space with the little bag and the presents. Um, you'll see what I did later. Now I got this Merry Christmas sign from Hobby Lobby. Of course, Hobby Lobby has a ton of Grinch stuff, but it can be expensive. I did go on the budget side of this and I got some cheaper ornaments from Amazon, the little felt ornaments. And as the years go, I will start collecting more. This is my first year doing Grinch. So I got a pretty good start, but it is expensive for the Hallmark ornaments. They are like 10 to $15 a piece. So keep that in mind when, if you're starting with Grinch, take your time. It does take time to build a collection. Don't try to buy everything. It's just not possible. So now we're just gonna start putting our treats. I've got some mint M&Ms and then some of those soft melted like um, peppermints. They melt in your mouth if you know what I'm talking about. Just gonna add our straws, our candy canes. Those peppermint napkins that I showed earlier, those are from Hobby Lobby as well. Now this little sign, little Grinch, Happy Holidays, and the little Ho 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 ornaments you'll see here in a minute. Those are from Walmart. Walmart had a ton of really cute Grinch stuff and it was super affordable. You'll see um, later I did get another Grinch parking sign that's to the left of my coffee bar and then there was the sign at the top that says I need coffee or I ate all the donuts or something like that. It's at the top of my coffee bar. I also got that from Walmart. Now those little beanies are so cute. Got those from Hobby Lobby. And then these mugs are from Williams and Sonoma. I only got three. Um, they are very pricey, but oh, just you can't beat these. They're adorable. And then these mugs are actually from Walmart from Valentine's Day, but it was a red heart and a heart mug, so I thought it fit with the theme. Now these are little present ornaments from Hobby Lobby. I just hung them on the hook there. Now this garland I got from Etsy, but it was very pricey. I found it later on Amazon for half of the price. So definitely check Amazon before going to Etsy. Some people just resell it on Etsy and it's very infuriating. 
you know, finding something for double the price, knowing that they probably got it on Amazon. So moving on, we're gonna start adding the, you know, syrups and toppings and stuff. That peppermint placemat is from Hobby Lobby many, many years ago. Everyone asks about them. I also have a table runner, but I got it so many years ago and I haven't seen it um, since. So sorry, maybe check um, Amazon or Home Goods. Those kind of places have cute little runners and placemats like that. Now these salt and pepper shakers are from Hobby Lobby. I'm not using them for salt and pepper, obviously, but I just like the little touch that it gives. And me, hang by the fire and chill. Isn't this how it is supposed to be? And this cup of cheer sign is from Hobby Lobby. So, and I've been long to hold. Grinch spoon rest and plate, both from Hobby Lobby again. Now I would link all this stuff for you guys, but most of the time it's sold out. It's really, really hard to link that stuff because 90% of the time it sells out as soon as they post it. So you kind of just have to keep your eye out. Now this garland I got from Walmart. They had a few different designs. I love this one with him with the tree. It was really cute. Just decided to drape it along the side there. Take our little mugs and put them up here. Now this is that sign I was talking about, Grinch parking only. I wanna say it was like seven or eight bucks. I don't remember exactly, but I know it was under $10. I got that from Walmart. Now these came from Hobby Lobby. They put them out later this year. I thought I wasn't gonna be able to find any Grinch towels, but finally they started putting more Grinch stuff out. They kinda of do it in phases, so keep that in mind. I also got these little Grinch lights. I don't know if you can tell, cause I can't really on camera, but they are little Grinch heads and it puts off like a nice lime green glow. Now here we are with those cookies again. I'm putting these out for my daughter mainly and my son, he'll probably grab one as well. And they were really good, had like a cream cheese frosting, so I really liked them. Now moving on to my tree, I did go ahead and do most of this off camera just because it takes so long. I'm so particular um, in placing everything and I kind of redo it sometimes. But that little Grinch hand holding the ornament, that was from Walmart as well. And then you'll see a lot of my Amazon felt ornaments. And this tree skirt also came from Amazon. Really cute, love it. It's very small, it's not meant for a larger tree, so keep that in mind. This is a pencil tree that I have here. And then of course those presents from Hobby Lobby, I have four of them. This is another sign from Walmart, sorry your gift got grinched, love that. I'm telling you, check out Walmart, tons of cute Grinch stuff at a fair price. And then that Santa stop here sign is from Kohl's. Now here I'm just showing you, I wanted more of these light bulb ornaments, so I ordered some from Walmart, got them delivered, and then just added them to the top just to tie in all of the multicolored ornaments that I got from Hobby Lobby. The ball ornaments, they are from Hobby Lobby. The Mr. Grinch metal sign, the little Grinch head, I don't know if you can tell that they're metal, but those are from Walmart as well. Again, such good stuff. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed my Grinch coffee slash cocoa bar. I do do both. We love our hot cocoa, and of course, I love my coffee. So let me know in the comments down below which part is your favorite or if you have any of these items. I know a lot of you are asking for links, but it's unfortunately with Hobby Lobby especially, they are notorious for being sold out. Walmart also, um, it's hit or miss with them this late in the game. I know it seems early, it's not even December, but truly, if you want this stuff, you gotta shop early. Um, I will link that Grinch haul down below that I filmed this year, um, as well as my Grinch treats video from a few years prior. If you guys love the Grinch like I do, this is my first year getting into decorating for Grinch, so I hope I did a good job. So with all that being said, I hope you guys have a great day or night wherever you are, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Just coming to visit